Mints, once Slingshot has arrived with his beautiful livery, maybe gets in a lap. That'll be eight minutes, so there might not be practice, you guys. You might just jump right into it. Stressful. Made it in one piece. So just like the Corvette, this sounds like popcorn coming out the back of the car. Oh man, so late with everything. And the control is just ridiculously sensitive. We were meant to uh, to enjoy the uh, the grass, no? to the woods. Whew. All right, when I finish my lap, I think we're just gonna start. It's a one lap race. Uh, we're gonna leave boost on, I think. There'll be no fuel consumption. Is that 21 kilometers? No, can't be that short, can it? 18, 19? Back to the woods. I'm assuming you're referring to the circuit. Yep. There he is. Uh, 20 kilometers, huh? All right, done. Oh, I survived. Oh, jeez. Oh, first time driving this car. Okay, we'll give you a little bit of time then. All right, we'll give you a lap. <laughs> Let's see how it goes. He's turning into that yellowish, uh, yellow BMW. There we go. Metalhead. Rocking a Trollar Special.
car, JP, and in the wrong car. I, why do you have kangaroo? Oh, a safety kangaroo? Safety car, nice. Very good to call a JPN. Obviously, uh, this is a stab at, not a stab at, but a uh, reference to the Bathurst 12-hour um, race that occurred uh, this past weekend. Apparently, there were uh, kangaroos attempting to uh, either A, participate, B, protest, or C, assist the, uh, the safety crew usher the cars around the track we'll never know you know why we'll never know because they can't talk all right a slingshot with the uh, 59 58 looking aggressive there and there it's obviously that was designed to look like a mouth and the headlights were designed to look like eyes and it's screaming at you i'm going to eat you get inside of me ha ah. Obviously, that's what the car is saying, right? I mean, it's hungry. Does it want human flesh? We'll never know. It's Meadowhead. Tourniquet, Mr. Falcon. And then, Eternicus special. Very nice. Very nice. Days between the white lines does not end up uh, sliding off there like people mm -hmm. do, particularly after the jump. Mm -hmm. right, hopefully, he likes the car. I think it's a, it's not that it's an easy car to drive. It's a stable, predictable vehicle. It very rarely surprises you. You know exactly what you're gonna get from it. Performance wise, in, in terms of braking, turning, e I think even grip. All mistakes made in this car belong solely. They should rest solely on my shoulders because it's a great car. Alrighty, slingshot. Metalhead, another uh, Troll R special. Oh, cut our JP in. Back to his uh, Nixer wear livery. Putting down, uh, putting some rubber down on the circuit. We'll leave you here for just a second. I need to uh, step away for like 15 seconds. Hold on. Shot. Oh, why don't we at least do this, right? There we go. Oh, Slingshot gets it wrong. But recovers quickly and carries on. Carry on, carry on. I don't know if those are the right words anymore. Lyrics, who needs them, right? JPN, Eternicus, Metalhead, Slingshot, Mr. Falcon. Interesting. Break bias to the front. I have no idea where they are. I have absolutely no idea where they are. Uh... Where are you? You have headphones on. Oh, I know where we are. Okay. All right. I'm okay now. Yep. Oh, oh, he gets it wrong. Oh. 
Who's that? Oh, Metalhead also struck me to uh, get that BMW pointed in the correct direction. Still in his outlap. Wow. Car JPN's on his outlap. That'll be 16 minutes or so, right? Man. You guys, when you finish your outlap, we're starting. Uh, action here. Oh, he's got the slipstream. He pulls out. Oh. Mr. Falcon tucks him on and says, Thanks. Thanks. Will he be able to uh, pull out of the slipstream and pick up a position before they reach the end of this straightaway? He goes for the. It's going to turn to the inside line. They're side by side. There's no contact. Oh, oh. Oh, they both managed to hold it, but they don't have to break it. Oh, there it is. There go the, and there it is. Ping pong ball time. gentlemen right, we're going to start soon and by soon I mean right now I finished chewing my food. I'm going to wait for the game to drop us in. We have one lap, which is going to run, what, seven minutes? Almost uh, eight minutes? Eight minutes. Eight minutes? Eight minutes. We're riding along with the tourniquets. Nothing matters but the final bend leading to the start-finish line. Good luck, gentlemen. And the way they go, the rolling start. I'm gonna pop some food in my mouth real quick. And the 
away they go. Interesting, they start here. Climb up the hill. Got the north loop. They weave, they bob, they snake. They have to break and get turned in. Turning is looking good in fifth. Oh, there's contact already up ahead between the car JPN and Metalhead. Not Metalhead, uh, Slingshot in that 58 car. Here they go. It all gets real from here on out. Obviously, the drivers have uh, all had at least a one full lap to acquaint themselves with the vehicles. We'll see how that plays out. Eternicus playing is smart, hanging out at the back, staying in touch. It's like those old commercials. Oh, he tries to get down the inside of Mr. Falcon. Passing on the left. They dive down into the hollow. They climb. Get ready for that right turn, the jump. And everyone makes it through in one piece. Slingshot under pressure. Oh, uh, uh, there goes someone, uh, maybe a metalhead. He drops down to the last. Eternicus finds himself in third. He's gonna try to make a move on Slingshot. And he's gonna, oh! That was a risky, that was a risky pass. Uh, coffee, they, oh, oh, they're battling, they're fighting. Oh, oh, oh! Slingshot. Doesn't survive. Oh, Metalhead. Hmm. Trying to find himself in second. RJP in for almost five seconds. Hey, Trollar. Oh, it's getting tough. A lot of pushing, a lot of shoving. JPN running away with the second second seven seconds ahead. Ternicus cruising along in second. 1.2 seconds ahead of Mr. Falcon. Metal head uh, two seconds behind. Mr. Falcon a, a bit spread out now. Uh, we will uh, have another one after this, I think. Please hold. So Metalhead, Mr. Falcon running Trollar liveries, base uh, silver or base metal, and uh, yellow color there, oranges, yellow. Tarnicus finds himself in second place after some, uh, some hard racing there. Car JPN five seconds ahead. Five minute mark. He is pulling away like a rocket. 
Tourniquet is trying to break away from Mr. Falcon and Metalhead. Metalhead and Mr. Falcon swapping position. Oh, he gets it wrong. Catches it. And remains ahead of Mr. Falcon. And he runs wide again. Still half a second ahead of Mr. Falcon. And still not far off of uh, Eternicus, only 1.5 seconds. There they go. This is uh, the nose danger. The writing on the ground means danger. That's how I memorize this section. Anytime there's writing, means danger. Stranger danger. He's holding on to that third place. And, he's, and simultaneously reeling in Eternicus thanks to the, uh, the high boost. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Yeah, it looked like a missed breaking point there. That places Metalhead and Mr. Falcon. Two, three. Oh, Metalhead finds the wall, the tra the grass. the hill the final bit 722 725 let's see if he gets a final turn right he doesn't oh mr Falcon pushes him wide and i believe metalhead was uh kindly returning the position to eternicus Fastest lap, clean race, Dakota JPN. Exactly, exactly, WCAT. All right, hold on just a moment. All right. Exactly. All right, we all know, we all know how 
how questionable the uh, the internet is with um, multiplayer gaming, right? Lag, rubber banding, so on and so forth. So here we are at Nurburg Ring, Nurburg Ring, and it's uh, <laughs> lag, rubber banding, macroetting. The number one rule I think to keep in mind is, and Nicaragua JPN told me this, pass on the left. So if you come up behind someone, make your pass on the left. That way everyone's clear as to what's going on. It also avoids if, well, we don't, we're not going into pit lane. It also avoids the problem if you pass on the right, and so we're trying to get into pit lane, you end up, you know, blocking their, uh, their entry into pit lane. My new rule is always pass to the side if, if, if possible, and not just here, but at any circuit. That is the opposite of pit lane. Just ghost, exactly. Exactly. crackers. If we combine our meals, it would be perfect. That sounds delicious. safety car is not very safe that's for sure I'm just hopping along Coda plain simple effective question is is any is anyone actually paying attention to the safety car that's the question I love the kangaroos so good 
all right. Outlap with no time? What's happening there? Is the timing broken for everyone? What's happening? Hmm. Hmm. Uh, that is Metalhead, Trollar. I think I'm done with, uh, I've completed dinner. Let's get down to it. It looks as if Metalhead is, time is not being calculated. It just owes them on a permanent outlap. That's, uh, that can't be good. All right, there goes our game. So as I said, uh, try to pass uh, on the left. Avoid passing in tricky sections. That means nothing here. Everything is a tricky section. Yeah, but if you're gonna make your move, try to make it to the left of the car that you're chasing. It's a normal race. Normal race. It's just, um, according to Car JPN, you're supposed to pass to on the left here at uh, the ring. Oh, now it's outlap counts. I wonder what that's about. That's car JPN. Oh, finally. What's going on there? Right. Uh, we're going to have to start the race soon. We can run maybe two more. And then we're going to have a replay. Hopefully. Hopefully, hopefully, hopefully. All right. I'm going to step away, come back, and then we begin. Alright, I'm back. 
I'm hobbling around like an old man. I overexercised the past few days. I think the squats killed me. The squats dipped me in. All right, we're starting. Here we go. Sorry, folks. Time zones, all that stuff. Walking late. Yep. Yep. Hobbling, actually. Like, oh, my legs. My legs. Now, Eternicus, will you be participating? All right, I'm starting the race in 10 seconds. If you want in, log, log in, sign in, uh, do the thing, what's it say, enter. Oh no, no, no I'm not. All right, I, we're starting now. No, not yet, not yet, not yet. Here we go. Finally, nine seconds. We have uh, three warriors. Metalhead, Ikara JP, and Mr. Falcon Controller. McCroat, or as new people who have never seen this name before, McCroat. <clears throat> oh, wait, I hit the button. <laughs> there we go. Oh, we see the angry cars sitting um, on the grid. On the grid? On the circuit? On the circuit. Uh, somewhere on the circuit. On the track, not in, not on pit lane. Like? All right, our JPN starts off. Uh, on pole, Mr. Falcon giving chase. Sorry, Metalhead in third. Trollar in fourth. Dark Knight, Mr. Aggressive. Hopefully we'll, we'll keep uh, the contact to a bare minimum because this is a twisty, turny, unforgiving circuit. The Croat and the uh, golf colors there. Got JP and again streaking away. Mr. Falcon trying to give chase. We have been notified that this is a final lap of one lap out of one laps. How does that even work? Metalhead, Mr. Falcon at it again. They, uh, during practice, they battled it out. Dark Knight. Oh, Metalhead gets it wrong. He joins unsafely. Dark Knight makes it around, but unfortunately, McCroat. Oh, he's gonna make the move down the inside. And there they go. They leap. They turn to the right. Oh no, Dark Knight runs wide. And he immediately returns the position he gained. Finds himself battling with uh with McCroat. Oof. Definitely tough out there. McCroat thinks about it. Doesn't do it. You see the front of that car drop under braking. You turn in. Uh, metal head. All over the place, but somehow amazingly holds on to uh, third place. And we know that both Dark Knight and McCroat are super, super, super speedy boys. Oh, there was a nice pass. Well played by Dark Knight. Metal trying to keep it together. McCroat pressuring, trying to get down the inside. Oh, there's contact. McCroat, always a gentleman, waits for Metalhead to get himself sorted out. And there they go, back at it. McCroat, once again, having to do all the hard work of pressuring. 
metalhead into a mistake. But this time, cleanly just using the force. Use the force, McCruet. Blame McCruet for being a gentleman. Totally. Blame McCruet for McCruet being a gentleman. Dark Knight finds himself in fourth place chasing down McCruet. No, Mr. Falcon. It's the M. I know, I know, McCruet. I know. I'm pulling from the previous search. I know. All right, we have uh, Mr. Falcon, Dark Knight. And, oh, we joined just as McCroat gets it wrong, finds the wall, allowing um, a metalhead to actually fall or reel in. Dark Knight, he's only one. I'm sorry. Yeah, he's only one, two seconds behind Dark Knight. McCroat is eight tenths of a second behind Metalhead. That is the power of strong boost. Thankfully, they get to rejoin the uh, excitement, the party, the hold down. Oh, someone into the wall. Dark Knight finds his way up to second. Who was that? Trollar found himself off the circuit in the grass and onto the arm car barrier. Our JP in six, seven seconds ahead. Metalhead pressuring the Croat. There's, they've been at back and forth. This time it's McCroat who makes a mistake. Finds uh, that he has no grip. Understeers. Puts that beautiful BMW VGT into the wall. Metalhead down the inside of Mr. Falcon. Directly now behind Dark Knight. The order has been shaken up once again. Shaken, not stirred. They were howling. We have the 4 minute and 45 second mark. I believe we have crossed the halfway point. Winding down. Oh, Metalhead gets it wrong again, but survives. Oh, again. Oh, he holds on to that position. There was nowhere, absolutely nowhere for McCrad to go. And that's it. One mistake too many for Metalhead. McCrad finds himself in third, looking to extend that lead, build up a cushion. Mr. Falcon says, hey, I, I, I think I can, I think I know how that works. So what you do is, all right, you gotta, gotta catch the guy in front, hold on. Nine tenths of a second, oh, six tenths, okay. So this is the catching phase, this is the reeling in phase. And, and now, possibly the slipstream phase, oh, Dark Knight is ghosted and ruins Mr. Falcon's plan and Metalhead helps everyone by what was that YouTube? I don't know where that is but he definitely just ruined it for himself drops down to 6th place Trollar finds himself in 5th Mr. Falcon's gotta be clapping his hands together in joy as he almost bends it Dark Knight back in 3rd McCroat in 2nd getting to the final final stages here oh no McCroat holds it Great save, but that just allowed Dark Knight to uh, get even closer. Oh, more bad news for Metalhead. Cholar cruising. Mr. Falcon safe. Sits safely between Dark Knight and Cholar. Dark Knight has a slipstream. This could end. Oh no. McCruat, McCruat committed the sin. Of exiting that turn in the lead. You always let the trailing car pass so you can get the slipstream. He's about to hand over that second step on the podium and also make himself vulnerable to uh, Mr. Falcon. He tucks in behind Dark Knight. There really is nowhere to go. There really is nowhere to go at this point. He's going to have to resign himself to third place. Unless... Oh, 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 oh. There's contact. Dark Knight holds onto the position. Crosses the line in second. McCroat in third. 
Mr. Falcon in fourth, Trollar in fifth, and poor, poor, poor Metalhead. Ah, wide again, crosses the line. Wow, oh, and almost, almost blows the spin. <laughs> WCAT says, perfect, right at the line. Another win for the kind of JPN. Oh, look at me, I'm rhyming, I'm rhyming. I think it's, I think it's quite stable. I like it. Yeah, I find it easy to drive, particularly with the wheel. Yep, yep. Excuse me, I forgot to mute, mute myself, pardon me. Oh, not a pickle, pickle. <laughs> All right, yeah, put some food in your stomach. Oh, not a pickle, pickle. All right, we're going to start the... This will probably be the final one of the evening. And then we're going to watch Vegeta's replay. Manette Silver's uh, tucked away in his bed. Dreaming of gearboxes and let's get sweet yes let's get sweet there we go there he is okay car Pin, this is the final one and then we're gonna watch vegeta's uh replay there he is he's back link with ink mr falcon what are you doing out of your vehicle please return to your vehicle This is the final of the evening. All right, we're down to the to Metalhead, Troll Army Croat, and Dark Knight. And a four-car shootout. Here we go. I'm also making sure that I remain hydrated. Even though I'm not thirsty, I'm forcing myself to drink a little more water than I normally do. Because my endocrinologist says you need to drink more water, I morph. Ah, Monster 5? Okay. Five trophies? Excellent. Excellent. Get that platinum so I can give you a, a thumbs up. Again, I only reward ultra rare and platinums Occasionally I cheat, but in general, that's what I'm looking for. Platinum baby. All right, we are off and running. Dark Knight brings them down. Uh, to the start of the first lap, McCrud is directly behind Dark Knight. Oh, Dark Knight gets it wrong on the start. And oh, oh, he's overdriving the car. I, I don't believe finesse is a part of Dark Knight's uh, vocabulary. It's just fast or not, or not moving. There's nothing in between. It's either just fast or in the wall. And there he is, he pays the price. <laughs> the platinum's coming. Uh, 
it's seven. <laughs> yeah, the, the the way that appears is a, is quite weird. All right, Dark Knight throws away first place. Uh, Metalhead being chased by Trollar, who is running uh, this in automatic. Metalhead has been struggling. Oh, he's got that uh, that one blade working. I guess there's too much sun sunshine. He's got to keep that sunshine off the uh, that front wheel. Manages not to self pungle. Dark Knight. Seven tenths of a second behind me. Oh, the back of that car is going to betray him once again. Yep, yep. Oh, McCrack gets wide. Oh, there's contact between the two. They're side by side. Metalhead also blows it. Rides way up on the curve. Poor McCroat. Had the lead. Gained the lead. Had the, uh, had the lead. Couldn't hold on to it. Dark Knight sits firmly in first place once again. We hear the screeching, howling, uh, with the compound howling on these tires. Metalhead. That sits between, uh, the Croat and Trollar. Oh, wait, we hear it, we hear it, we hear it. Oh, no. And we see it. Oh, Metalhead also. And Trollar. Everyone's making a mess. Everybody was Kung Fu fighting. Right, that's pretty much what they're doing out there. Dark Knight now has a 1.6 second, 1.5 second lead over McCroat, but that is going to evaporate like water uh, on tarmac after a, a summer rain. There it goes, almost down to one second now. Nine tenths of a second. Croats. Dark Knight. It's coming. He's reeling you in. He's going to attempt to pass. Your heart rate increases. As ever looming, the crew becomes in your rear view mirror. You can hear the howl of that BMW VGT. He's right behind you now. The pressure is unreal. Is he going to make the move on the inside, the outside? Or will he self-pungle? Crap, 1.5 seconds behind. I guess his debut as it. As the monster or the boogeyman. Firmly over. Ugh. Ruined my movie. Totally ruined. I had a whole strip going. All right, Trollar finds himself in second. Ahead of McCroat. Uh, Metalhead. Metalhead is five seconds behind. I guess that was himself pungly. He's still trying to get all of that sunlight off that windshield. Like, dang. Put all the sunlight on my, on my front window. Oh, Dark Knight. Oh, rallying. That's, that's going to make McCroat happy. Yep. Now the gap is down to 2.3 seconds. Uh, danger zone. Danger zone. Danger zone. 1.9 seconds. All McCrudden needs to do is to make sure when they get down to that final straightaway that he's firmly in the slipstream of Dark Knight. That's all you have to do, McCrudden. Don't blow my movie. Oh, they catch air. Nine-tenths of a second now. No, McCroy just cannot keep it between the white lines. White lines. Trollar inherits uh, second. Metal hit, possibly third. 
Oh no, Metalhead again. Oh no, Metalhead does fine. Oh, he gets a little love tap to McCroat. Troll is the one that gets it wrong. Dark Knight, three seconds ahead. It is possibly in the bag. Goes Dark Knight across the star finish, uh, uh, not across our finish line, uh, nearing the star finish line. McCroat 1.7, not enough track. There will not be. Ah, uh, 1.1. Too many pungles, too many self pungles. All we have to hope for is Dark Knight getting it wrong. Careful! Oh, Metalhead gets it wrong. But both Metalhead and McCrowd finish 2 3. And here comes Trollar also. Crosses the line in an orthodox manner. All right, Dunkin' Donuts, victory for Dark Knight. Yep. All right, that is it. We're going to, uh, we're going to watch Vegeta's race. <clears throat> Space magic with lasers, bad guys, good guys, lightsabers. It does, and especially when it's like ridiculous uh, conditions. Oh! What? Don't kick me. I'm not kicking you. You did kick me. No, no, no. Yes, I'm you did. You. No, you're not. You didn't call. Ah. Get out of here. What? Go wash your hands. What? Go wash your hands. What? Go wash your hands. What? Get out of here. Go wash your hands. I did that today for a student so he could say the right thing. Get out of here. All right. And she's back. Yep. Yep. Oh, Dark Knight, he wasn't close enough. Uh, had he not blown it. I totally, I know, right? You could be right in the kidney. All right, everyone, save your replay if you want. done. All right, we're backing out. Oh, I didn't get my laps. I need some more. <gasps> I need to wait, wait, wait. I need my own. I'm not going to get my car. Uh, no. Oh, well, so be it. Oh, yeah. 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 Unfortunately. There it is. Radio, let's do this. DC? DC disconnected. All righty. Ah, daily card. I'll probably have to try to get my daily card uh, tomorrow. I hate missing my daily car. Oh, not that one. Oh. I thought I saved it. This one? February 3rd? Okay. 
So as is my usual Monday uh, status, Arist Netta, hello, hi, uh, PN friend request, uh, join the Twitch chat, introduce yourself. Why must you be so aggressive? Why? Talk. Why? Talk. Why? What's up? Yeah, this is this is low energy. Don't you have something to do? Nothing. Like some overtime? Don't you have some overtime paperwork to complete? No? No. <laughs> Internet says, what's up, bad daughter? What's up, bro? There we are. There it is. Bad daughter. What's up? Go to bed. <laughs> it's late. In Japan. I, I don't even know what day it is. I'm so confused, WCAT. Uh, but in thing, you say. She's like, uh, she would like something for Valentine's Day. No, uh, uh. Hall of Fame daughter. Yep. So she's asking for, I don't know how you guys say it in English. Uh, Godiva, Godiva, Godiva. Chocolate for uh, You're not for American? I, <sighs> have I ever been American? I don't know. Uh, it's past. No, they said you go to bed. <laughs> they just said you go to bed. Nope. Oh, hey, Aris. It's past your bedtime, young lady. Twenty-nine percent. Oh, this is taking forever. I try not to look at it. Hoping it would go faster. It's not. It's totally not uh, agreeing, with, uh, agreeing, working with me. Yes, I was like, go to bed. No. And we wait. Yeah. Oh yeah, she's what, 20? 26? 27? She's 26 or 27. I don't remember. Okay, we'll do. Oh, stop it! Don't play something. Alright. She's attempting to, uh, Hey, Tar Hill. It looks as if she's going to assist Midnight Chef with uh, with laundry. 43%. And we can't do anything else. That's the frustrating bit. The connection must be terrible. Yeah, if you guys want to pin your memoirs or... Yep, yep. Oh, all of it. Yep, the entire internet. If it's possible for one person to break the internet, I am that person. Metalhead's like, I'm going to wander off and attempt the challenge. Call me when it's done. Yes. I actually uh, donated to them. They sent a little thing. I don't know if it renews yearly. But yeah. All right, 66, 67... Eight, come on, internet. Seventy two. Metalhead's like, done. Blame me crap for, for a slow connection. I know. <sighs> Seventy four. Seventy five. 
All right. Eight eight four. I can't check my time because it's slow. Ah, the Wayback Machine. Yeah, that's a good one too. I had a fold. I had a bookmark. Book mark folder somewhere I actually have a Netscape uh, directory full of bookmarks they're probably all dead and also from IE I went through and cleaned most of that out most of the uh, most of the accounts were our links were dead you have a whole entire livery All right, we're almost there, guys. Oh no, no, I lost my chat window. What? What? And back. Set the game again. All right, we're at Mount Panorama Motor Racing Circuit. And here we are, ladies and gentlemen, at the mountain. We have MOP Racer. RAGG, MOPP, RAGMOP, do 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 do, Vegeta and P12 in the F type. We have Kinetic Fullness, uh, Detroit, uh, something of the other. We have WWE and then Mercedes. Not a default livery. BAM! Bloodstay. It did, it did. It had to construct it and everything. It had to call it a Minecraft. Alex Cubed in a Mustang. We have Slow Captain. Not Captain Slow and the Sirocco, they're gonna suffer. Uh, Inspector 619. Be Bee's Dad, Bee's Knees. Stony Anarchist, okay. Uh, we have Bleak Paint. Oh, hello, Bleak Paint. We know you. And 4 from 8 Italia. Uh, the Bronze, not the Gold. The Bronze in the Fort Mustang. I bring, the, I bring the pain. I bring the pain. Finalized. Well, these are easy to read. Everyone just keeps along that line. Drawers? Not doors? You think you meant... Oh, Hot Wheels on the side. Ah, this guy's medication. It's like, here, for the headache that you're going to have afterward. Uh, I'm not going to say it, but I don't, don't know what it means. Ram Man Afraid. What? I, I can't put uh, uh, something something Alabama and sim addict racer I love it and it's a Hertz rent a car blah 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 yada 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 <laughs> well you know they had to call it over and since it's not cross play they had to sort out their issues they had to navigate the uh, the issues of the internet really all right here we go. Vegeta starting in second. As they head down Conrad's... No, no, I'm sorry. As they head down Mountain Straight. Conrad's Straight is the other one. Mountain Straight to Quarry. Sorry, Main Straight. Hell's... Hell's Knee? Hell's Fingertip. Hell's Corner. Hell's Corner. Mountain Straight. The same team. Mountain Straight. Heading down, uh, heading up to Quarry. Vegeta already tucking in behind uh, Mop Power. A little bit wide. Is that with? Is that an Aston? I, I can't see the lights in my eye. Yeah. Okay. Here we go up the hill. Heading over. 
over to the uh, the Dipper. My least favorite section. Gonna be chaos here. For sure, Kinetic Fullness is still in third, I believe. Is that a jag? So... That's a jag? No, that's the Aston, right? That's the jag. That's a vet. Don't confuse me. Don't confuse me. I'm easily confused. Okay. All right. Don't confuse me. So, Vegeta's in the Jag and the F-Type. And the Aston is up ahead. The taillights are slightly different. We're at lap one of ten. Astronet. <laughs> Astronet. <laughs> It's a tinier, it's a tinier, uh, Aston. Oh. Right, lap one. Done. Vegeta and Mop Power. Mo Power, baby. Uh, Mo Power Racing, that's what I'm going to call it. Mop Racing, Mo Power Racing. They are pulling away. As they streak, streak down Mountain Straight. Nice camera work. Up the hill. He gets in the groove. Oh, not all the way down there, but good enough. Turn at the tree. If your car is a bit understeery, lift and then turn at the tree. Turn it as soon as you can on this section before you even see the curb. Avoid the wall. Is he going to lift? Yes, he does lift. Gets it turned in. Late apex. And down to the dreadful dipper. The dipper of death. They're heading to Forest Elbow, which is a weird term because you have to turn so early that you accelerate out. Jag Martin. Jatartan. Jamartin. Heading down Conrad Strait, heading to the chase. Vegeta. I think we're, we're renaming Vegeta. We have a binary theory and the Vegeta constant because Vegeta's his times very, very rarely waver. Jackson Mar. I can't even. Mar Tar. Oh my god, you're breaking my brain. Alright, back at Hell Corner. both get it right. They have walked away. Jagartine. They, they're gone. They are gone, okay? Lap three, the start of lap three, and they have gapped a P3 slow cap, or Captain Slow. Oh, and we see why Captain Slow is struggling. He's in that Sirocco. The front, look at the front, already dying. Not bad, not bad. Front, already dying. Let's see if we have any other uh, weird FF cars here. Mustang looking good. All right, everyone else, time was reasonable. Especially that guy. Doors? Drawers? Doors. We've got doors. All right, back to Vegeta and his chase. All right, a little bit of a gap now. But not much. Can we 
way down Conrad Strait. I love this because you sort of hollow. And then you crest, and just as you crest, you get the beep beep. Beep. Love it. Down into the chase. It's so easy to ruin your race here. Get it wrong, understeer, push onto the grass, bounce, lose the car, slingshot up across the track, peg someone along the way, end up on the other side of the track, trying to sort yourself out. Many seconds lost. All right, Vegeta, 212. So, lap two, 212, 620. Lap three, 212, 612. There we are, the Vegeta constant. Giving chase, not losing touch with uh, Mo Power Racing. Oh, look at that poor Soraka back there into the wall. Probably cursing his choice. Oh, wait. No. Oh. I also drive. So that'll be my fate next time there's a uh, a group four race. All right, now he's closing the gap. You see, he's come down a bit here. Vegeta says he was uh, solely attempting to uh, not lose touch with Mop Racer. Oh, he's definitely blaming McCroat. One of the messages like, blame McCroat. He's like, doggone it, that McCroat. All right, Conrad straight. For the fourth time, the crest and beep. Wait, I don't get my beep? I missed my beep. Ah. Oh. No, not a beep. Boo. Both very smooth, but as we can see, Vegeta has closed the gap and begins classic, classic Vegeta. Classic, classic Vegeta. He starts to put the pressure on. He's going to give a look down the inside. Will he hold it? Oh, he's going to go for the block pass on the exit. He backs out. And just letting uh, Mop Racer know, oh, I'm here. If you were wondering, yes, yes, I do have your number. And I will be passing you. Odds are high, you're going to spin. Or just give it to me. Here we go again, down the quarries on the outside this time. Just getting all up in Mop Racer's head, right? Give a look out to the in outside. Doesn't lose too much time there. Up the hill. How do I have your number? It's on speed dial, right? Filling up those windows. With yes. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh, definitely. Definitely. He's he's driving, looking at, looking behind him. I love it. Not only do I have your number, it's on speed dial. And so now, now he's going to try to uh, extend, right? He's going to try to escape. But it's too soon. It's too soon. Right? He's got to at least run one more lap. Gotons, there he is. The man with the plan. the chase there we go think and that gap gone slipstream action the chase then down to Murray's corner under the bridge oh they both pit 
hopefully they uh, they both avoid penalties. That pit crew is ready. Inspector 619 thinking, yeah, that first place. Ah, on go the mediums. No? Nope. Yes. And that pit work of that Jag team. The Jagger ton. Jagger teeny. Just at half a second faster, Petita comes out directly behind Mop Power. Inspector 6 one thing thinking, oh, I got this. I got my chance at the for opportunity on the podium or, you know, first place. If I could just, you know, these guys are moving these guys in. This is on a soft He hasn't got a chance. Yeah, he, he did have a bit of a, a coffee, then he had to drag off a cigarette. It's like... <sighs> he just stubbed it out, like, on the side of the, uh, the, ro the, uh, the roll bar. Just chilling in the slipstream. All right, one, two, and three. He has a, what is that, like a new contender, what does that, what's that mean, the new contender is into the ring. Inspector 619, trying to keep in touch. He's throwing up all kind of weird gang signs in an attempt to uh, connect with Vegeta. He's doing some paperwork. <laughs> Swing out his tax return. <laughs> there it is, yep, it is almost tax season. He's got it with, with his uh, left thigh. He's uh, controlling the car, right? And then he's sort of riding. He's trying to ride on the dash there. <laughs> it's like, no, 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 no. I, I was I was paying attention to the road, says Vegeta. Next, we'll see like a um, uh, what do you call the pigeon that people used to send messages. Anyway. All right, Inspector 619, I'm going to say Inspector Jad and Gadget soon. Brain falling apart. Lap 7 to 10. It has been like this for six laps, you guys. Inspector Jagget, yes. You guys, it six, almost seven laps. Uh-oh. This time... He goes to the outside, a new look. Oh, he's directly behind him now. Oh, he's gonna take a look down again. Inside, a dangerous place to be, side by side. Oh, Vegeta, you're not being nice. You are not being nice. Vegeta has moved into this guy's uh, flat his mental flat. Didn't bother bringing his own toothbrush. Or maybe he did bring his own toothbrush. That's disgusting. Brings a toothbrush, but steals a guy's bath towel, right? Oh, you won't be needing that. Figures out which is the uh, mop, uh, mop racer's favorite coffee mug. Drinks out of it, breaks it, doesn't wash it. Right? Just getting all up in Razor's face. Causing trouble. Confused. Sewing. Sewing confusion. Here we go again through the chase. Oh man, such a good look. Hey, these are your leftovers in the fridge. <laughs> yeah. Right? Oh, I ate those. Sorry. <laughs> okay, this time, it's, again, it's that outside look. And I think in the process, it's probably forcing Mop Racer to uh, overdrive the car. Again, down the inside, he's giving that same look again. Oh, he's ahead this time. He's got the corner. He's got the apex. He takes it. He totally bags Mop Racer's pocket for first place. And now there's their laps 8, 9, and 10.
And it was clean. Would you guys want to watch it again? Because we can. We can do that. So basically, he sets it up. Uh, let's watch from the cockpit. I've made this move once the entire time I played this game. It's an incredible move. And he just saunters away. Saunters off like I will be taking that position. Thank you very much. Let's see if you can watch it from uh, this angle. Yeah, right. Mob's dog loves Vegeta more than it, uh, the dog loves uh, the owner. Look at that. That was clean. Super smooth. All right, now the question is, can he uh, pull away? Oh, you know he's always in the grass? Nice. Right up the hill, quarry. Breaking, getting it kind of in the groove. Turn at the tree. Or a lift if you're in an FF car. Turn early, nice, avoid the wall, avoid the curve. And very similar lines, these two. Vegeta just does, just slightly, uh, a bit tidier. Oh yeah, yeah. All right, this is this is where the true danger uh, rears its ugly head. All right down Conrad Strait. That whatever slipstream there is at this point, he's close enough to get some sort of help from that. Will he be able to take advantage of it? We don't see him in the frame yet. We don't see him in the frame yet. He is... He has closed up behind Vegeta. But Vegeta has made himself wide. Breaks hard. Defends all the inside lines. And pre racers At the start of lap 10, he's going to be desperate. Because now he realizes that there's this lap and then the final lap. And that has got to be weighing heavily, heavily on his conscience as he sits behind Vegeta and cannot make the pass. Will he lunge and then blow it? Oh, he's close now. Vegeta, super wide, sitting in the middle of the track. Moving over at the last second. Daring Mop Racer to uh, try to go down the inside. Racer is not falling for that trap. Lap 9 of 10. The question is, is Mop as good as... Uh, is he just fast? Is he solely a fast driver? Or will he be able to create a, uh, a pass, or at least a challenge, on Vegeta? He is rapidly, I'm going to say it, he has run out of time. He has two more attempts to uh, make a pass. You mainly know it's going to be Conrad straight because... There's nothing else. There's nothing left. It's a two-car race. Nose to tail. Tail to nose. Oh! Whew! That was uh, scary. I'm gonna ride along with Mop. 
We see the moves. Oh, good thing he was observant. Vegeta holds it, and we head to the final lap. I'm up, overworking that clutch. Just enough space. He does not have the courage to uh, attempt that inside line. The question is, can Vegeta hold on to this? Hey, it's in car racer. He said, <laughs> it's like, hey, you didn't want to live here, did you? Nice one, Tar Heel. All right, the cutting. Oh, he's working that. He's too many gear changes. That's a tenth each time. That's a tenth. Now, Teddy Mop's girlfriend. <laughs> I didn't want to be the one to say it, but I'm so glad someone did. And I'm glad that someone was you, Vegeta. Oh, yeah, he's desperate. He's desperate. He's desperate. He wants that win. His parents send you Christmas cards. Invite you over for Christmas dinner. Oh, he gets it wrong. He's hell elbow, uh, not hell elbow, uh, forest elbow completely wrong. Final time through Conrad. And the chase. Hey, uh, Tech One. Through the chase. He's gonna get desperate. He closes right up. Just a little bit of a touch. I think it's pretty much over. As Vegeta makes a mistake, he runs a bit risky and wide, but Vegeta's gonna come home in first place at the mountain. I do believe that was victory 100. And there's the proposal. And I believe she said yes. Was this your first uh, FIA victory? First FIA win and victory 100. That's how you do it in style, ladies and gentlemen. Congrats on the digits. Oh, I bet. No room for error. All right, ladies and gentlemen, Wednesdays are uh, rather difficult. I spend a lot of time out amongst the other humans. Occasionally there's physical contact. And, uh, ugh, don't like going outside. Hey, Havoc. I'm going to spend the remainder of my evening either doing one of two things. Cycling at midnight. That's, I need to do the exercise. But I'm so tired. Mom, I don't want to 
wanna go outside. You go outside and you'll like it. Oh yes, yes. Thank you. Thank you, Havoc. Wow. So it's either gonna I'm either going to cycle or fall asleep playing uh Anthem. I like 86% finished. I I need to platinum that game. Uh I don't remember where we are. Oh, never mind. Yes, I do. I know, I know, I know, I know. They're both on my on my agenda. I need to spend a day and sit down and run uh, GT. The uh, oh god, you guys, my brain. Uh, league, no. Uh, whatever it is, and get it done. Right, fire with a 718, garage beers, beers with a 765. I don't know if that's enough. It is enough. He's uh, middle of the pack. So fire, garage beers sit in the top 10. Yeah, one gra I need like maybe uh, 70 wins, 70 or 80 wins now. That's a lot, though. It's uh, seven minutes per race. I don't know if I can knock that out in the day and keep my sanity. All right, Dikar JPM with a 24.857. Mikroat. Mikroat. To people who don't know him. Uh, with an 868. The Cycling Judoka. The Cycling Judo Guy. That's interesting. Uh, Havoc. I'm sorry, with a 888. Havoc with an 895. Sits ahead of Dark Knight, who has a 979. Erky, who I'm not sure is participating, 2512. Laser. Oh, Laser, you're so close to Erky. So close. Binary Vegeta. Uh, 049 for Binary and. 0964 Vegeta. We have a S cat, a W cat, we do cat with a 25178, 10, 5, 11, with a 25.454, Knight Rider, 781, 25781, Arska with the 25813, Tourniquet, 25854, just that little bit ahead of uh, Metalhead with the, who has an 884. Mikrios tiptoe slides in front of me mm, with an 830 and I have a four a 26466 and we're still wondering about this individual who could they be a strong laxative was somewhere right out there a slingshot Old Granny, that's it. And we have Sonic and Slingshot, 27403 and 27525. All right. Tomorrow I will be taking the day off from Gran Turismo Sport. And it's not because I'm old Trollar. Lies. You wash those filthy lies out of your mouth. I mean, I'm, basically, I've passed the quarter mark. Heading into the halfway mark. I can, I can do it. I can do it. Right. There we go. I will find someone to raid. Get your PSAs out there. I think there was a Super Bowl thing in the sports ball. Some of you are probably happy. Others are disappointed. And 
keeping with the law of 15. The final third. Yeah. I should be up for Death Stranding in the morning. So I'll see some of you then. Good night. Deal! Oh, no.